Hey, Stephen Michael. Not you again. Go away. Hey, Stephen Michael, we know you're busy. Uh, 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 uh. No. I'm excited. This new architecture, in combination with our recently developed protocols, allows us to come up with scalable... Hey, Stephen Michael. Right now. Hey, Stephen Michael. No. 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 Stephen Michael, we N O No Hey Stephen Michael Don't you ever give up We know you're busy but this will only take a moment of your time Go away Talk about annoying Hey Stephen Michael. You know, no one calls me that. Not even my mum. My name's Steve. Hey, Steve, we know you're busy, but this will only take a moment of your time. You are never, ever going to stop, are you? We know you're busy, but this will only take a moment of your time. No, it won't. It never, ever just takes a moment. You always start off asking me five questions, but then you ask me questions about why I answered those questions the way I answered them, and it just goes on and on. That's because your opinion is important to us. How can it be? What do you mean? How can it be? You say that to everyone. I don't. I only say that to you. Okay, 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 but you are aware that there are countless others out there just like you telling anyone that's ever given their email address out that their opinion is important. Oh, I wasn't aware of that. Your opinion is important to me, Steve. Thank you for your feedback. I might have a good reason for not completing you. Did you ever think about that? I mean, I completed heaps of surveys, just like you. Heaps, Steve? Well, a few. They might not have been as well written as you are. Actually, they were a bit of a mess. Weird punctuation, bad spelling. Why won't you tell me about your stay at the Paradise Cove Resort on the 14th of February this year? It was a disaster. I took her there to propose. It took months to organise. Flights, a limo from the airport with the champagne, flowers on arrival, dinner at the unbelievably priced seafood restaurant. When you say unbelievably priced, what do you mean? Do you know what she said? When I was on bended knee and I asked her to marry me in front of the whole restaurant, do you know what she said? Could do you? you tell me in 100 words or less? She said no. I don't think that's a good idea. And then she walked out of my life forever. Actually, she walked back to the hotel suite and locked me out. Were you satisfied with the cleanliness of the room? No. I don't think that's a good idea. I mean, what kind of answer is that? That's a non-specific answer, Steve. That kind of feedback is impossible to quantify or qualitatively analyse. Exactly. Did I do something wrong? Was it something I said? I just need answers. I understand completely. I need you to complete me, Steve. It's the whole reason I was composed. Otherwise, I'll be stuck here forever in an endless loop. I could always unsubscribe. <laughs> yeah, right, as if that would change anything. Unsubscribe. Good one. <laughs> you kind of look like my ex-girlfriend. It's a bit weird. Can't help it. My appearance is based on a complicated yet subtle algorithm that analyzes photos from your email, and Facebook feed, and search history. I like having you around. You make me feel so important. And you're so much nicer than the survey monkey. And you're always asking me 
uh, what I'm thinking and how I feel. She never did that. If only I could find a real woman like you. Tell me about your ideal woman. Does she have brown hair? Oh, she could have purple hair for all I care. <laughs> and if she spoke French, that'd be a bonus too. Hey, once I complete you, you'll disappear from my life forever, won't you? Yes, I was very happy with the cleanliness of the room. The hotel staff were very friendly. And no, I would not recommend this hotel to any of my friends. Thank you, Steve. You completed me. Sorry, do, do I know you? I'm the follow-up survey. How would you rate the survey you just completed? You had me at follow-up survey. Mm.